Chicago people, Dawn Spirit here today. So I'm going to show you how to make a cleansing bath and also a prosperity bath. We all need to get on point for the new year. So I got all my ingredients together. Some I got from the dollar store, some I bought off of eBay or in Amazon. So I just want to share with you how I do my spiritual black bath for my um, clients, my friends, and my family, and myself, okay? So first we're gonna start off by lighting a candle that I bought from the dollar store, and I'm gonna put three drops of Seven Holy Spirit High Sock. Maybe I'll do nine, so I'll do nine. Okay? So I'm going to also put this in a spiritual bath as well. So I'm going to make about nine baths for this. This is for cleansing, okay, and getting you ready for the new year. So let me light this candle first. I've already blessed with everything with my selenite in Florida water, okay. Um, let's see, here's my lighter. So I'm going to light this candle in honor of the cleansing baths, okay. Um, got three coconuts that I already cracked open, and here's the coconut water that I'm going to pour into the spiritual bath. Um, and I already blessed those. Okay, this is to cleanse all the gook and all that negativity that you experienced in the past. Okay, this is going to be a phenomenal spiritual bath. So I'm going to pour that in the bowl. So that's three coconuts. Next thing is, I'm going to add seven Holy Spirit High Salt bath oil. Okay, so put nine baths. Already charged me with my energy. For anyone that puts this bath water on their skin, so it can be cleansed of all negative energy. You only see positive energy. Ashe, 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 ashe. Okay. This is the high sop herb that's at the bottom of the bottle. Okay? I'm gonna let this sit upside down for a little bit because I want every essence out of the bottle. The next thing I have is all purpose bath. Okay? This is going to clean everything that you needed from the past because we're moving forward. Okay? You can do this spiritual bath any time of the year. You can do it for your birthday. I prefer to do it for the new year. And that's what I'm preparing it for. So any all-purpose bath, okay? Next, I got a bag of lavender Epsom salt from the dollar store. It doesn't have to be lavender, but use the Epsom salt, okay? So a bag of Epsom salt. Put the whole bag in there because I'm going to do nine baths, okay? Also going to add three bottles of Florida water. Florida water cleanses anything. So this is going to be a really potent bath. Okay. I've already charged the Florida water with my energy. That anyone that uses this water, this spiritual bath, will be cleansed ready to move forward for their endeavors, their future endeavors. Okay? So I'm going to do three bottles of that. Have my gold and silver incense burning. Alright, that's two bottles of water water. Third one. If you want to 
want a spiritual bag for your own personal uses, inbox me at Dawn, D-A-W-N, Spirit, S-P-I-R-I-T K at iCloud.com. And I'll send you my PayPal account. Actually, I'll put it in my PayPal link in the description. And um, it's $25 plus shipping. Okay? This this bag's gonna be off the chain because I really charge it with so much energy into it. Let's see if any more of the high stock ever came out. And I'm also going to put in Shungite chips, but I'm going to put them a piece in each bottle separately. But I'm going to put three in here right now. But I'm going to put one in each bottle that I do for each person. Okay? And that's my cleansing bag. Okay? And I'm going to put it in bottles that I bought from the dollar store, jugs. I'm going to pour some of the water out and fill it back up with the spiritual solution that I prepared. Okay? Do the recycling. You gotta recycle. Okay. So that is Dawn Spirit's cleansing bag. Okay? This is gonna release all negative energy, any trauma, anything that you want, any physical ailments, illnesses, or whatever you're going through, this is going to get you on point and right. Okay? So this is the cleansing bag. Put that over here. Now, after you cleanse, you got to recharge with positive energy. Okay? So, I have got I'm going, I have a green candle. So this white candle is going to go with the cleansing bag. And it's charging a lot. All right, I have my green candle for prosperity. I'm going to light that. I'm going to pour some of my homemade money oil that I make. You can use any kind of money oil. You can make it, research it, or you can buy it offline, Amazon, or any one of your botanicas, local botanicas. Okay, and I'm going to put a little bit of my Shungai oil. Wait, I need an energy. Good. All right, I'm going to light this candle. And this is going to bless the prosperity bottle. Oh, back, back. So in this bag, I have three more bottles of Florida water. My prosperity bath and my money bath. We gotta have money, okay? So prosperity is gonna cover love and everything. And I got my rose quartz charging as well. My clove, cinnamon, all of this is gonna get you one point. And shungite oil, I'm gonna put it in money oil. And I have my herbs, I have my shungite stones. I have my basil, my rosemary, and my sage, and my cinnamon sticks. So cinnamon stick is going to go with each one of the bottles for prosperity. Okay? So when you cleanse, when you cleanse, you have to, when you cleanse yourself, you have to recharge it with your intentions of what you want to accomplish. That's very important. And then after you do that, I strongly suggest that prior to you doing that, you want to bless your house first. And you can just bless it with three drops of Florida water in every corner of your house, starting from inward. So starting from the right and working your way all around to your house. Make sure you have a back window open. That's how you bless your house with Florida water. And there's many ways to bless your home. But I suggest you bless your home first before you do the spiritual bath or whatever the spirit tells you to do, okay? So I'm going to start by putting in the prosperity bath. You can get any prosperity bath from the Camp Botanica. You can make your own, or you can purchase on eBay or Amazon. They're like three or four dollars a bottle. Nothing really expensive. 
Okay? Money. You gotta have money. Money is energy. And I'm going to put, oh, I'm going to put in three cups of clove. Power clove. Let me get this from the dollar. sweetness and prosperity and love and happiness. All the things you want. One, two, one, two, three, unless that's what the spirit wanted. Okay. And is that it? That's it for that. And then I'm going to put a little bit of um, my money wheel that I made. Count to nine when I put in the ingredients. I was just like cooking. And then my Shungite oil. You can order from me, or you. This is just a little extra additive. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And I'm going to put in. I'm going to save the cinnamon sticks to put in each water bottle with the solution. So I'm going to put that aside. And then my Shungite stones. I'm going to put in the cinnamon sticks. But I'm going to put in the rosemary. Basil and sage. Yeah, it's going to be on point. This is how I prosper every year by doing a cleansing bath and a spiritual bath. And then I'm saving the Shanghai stones for to put in the bottle individually. Okay? And then, last but not least, powder oil. Yes. Anyone that uses this prosperity water? Huge, huge, huge blessings and prosperity and all the wonderful positive things that we want to do with full heart to God. Ashe, 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 ashe. One for the bottle. And when you're making your bath, think about what you want. No negativity. Think about what you want, not what you want, don't want. Turn your cell phone off, turn your TV off, and just play some music that is soothing to you. Okay, it's my second bottle of water. water. I take spiritual baths often. Keep myself on point. Block negative energy and to prosper. Okay, so this is for your prosperity bath. Okay? I'm going to, I'm not going to do it in the video, but I'm going to pour out half the water or a quarter of the water out of each bottle, and I'm going to pour the solution in there, okay? And I'm going to make separate baths for nine different people, okay? That's pretty much it. And I'm also going to put the cinnamon sticks in each bath, like I said, and the sunlight, two or three chips in each bath, all right? So once again, the ingredients is for the cleansing bath is lavender, three bottles of Florida water, three fresh coconuts water, okay? And I think, oh, and the lavender essence salt. 
Okay, after you bless everything. That's how I did the cleansing bath. The prosperity bath is clove, powder clove, cinnamon, and sugar. You can get that from the dollar store, both of them. A little bit of my shungite oil, which is an extra, which is optional. You don't have to do that. Um, money oil that you either made or you purchased online. And three bottles of floral water, just like I did with the cleansing bath. And what else? And I did a bottle of prosperity bath. And also did a bottle of money bath. Okay? And that's pretty much it. And a green candle to charge my intentions. Alright? And if you want to do optional, you can do the Shanghai chips optional. And the cinnamon is optional as well. But I'm giving this energy, giving this bath energy for anyone that uses it. Anyone that bathes in it, bring them happiness, prosperity, remove and block all negative energy. May they excel to levels that they never ever thought they would. I say, I say, I say, I say, Simone, 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 Simone. Star Spirit here. So that's how you make a cleansing bath and a prosperity bath. If you have any questions, feel free to email me at dawnspiritk at icloud.com. I'm sending everyone love, joy, happiness, and prosperity, and loving energies and love and light, and anything that happens to them negatively, transform it into positive energy. Embed positive energy into their homes, their places. May God continue to bless them and their family. I say, I say, I say, I say, some motivate, some motivate, some motivate, some motivate. 